Kevin O'Sullivan here tonight. There's a lot of pop in the middle of this lineup, Weecho. Yeah, Coach Sully has some pretty good pop there. You see the top of the lineup. They started this year as one of the best offensive teams Coach Sully has had in his 10-year career there, the way they got started over the first four games. And you see the lineup, the way it stacks up there. Expect a lot of pop out of this lineup, a lot of scoring, even though it seems that the weather is going to favor the pitching this weekend. Man hoping to contain that Gators offense tonight is the right-handed senior, Weecho, Brian Van Bell, who turned in a terrific performance last Friday night against Rutgers. Yeah. Florida Gators lineup. Langworthy with the open stands from the other side. Swing and miss right three. Got him with a changeup. I, I tell you, Kyle, it's been a long time since I've seen this crowd as what happens at the end of the year. But for these kids, for these two programs, for the fans, it's great excitement to see a top ten matchups already in the year. Right center field. Rivera has it. And Brian Van Bell goes one, two, three in the top of the first inning. That's how the Miami Hurricanes line up tonight behind second year manager we chose Gino Damari, who went 41 and 20 in year number one. Yes, yeah. sixth junior out of Tampa, Florida. He too was good in his first outing of the season. Yeah, Tommy Mace has first round stuff. They look good fastball. He'll be in the low 90s consistent, consistently throughout the night. Fastball. That's the kind of a reputation that Castillo's had early in his career. There's a ball in the air, center field sinking fast. Then the first hit of the night goes to Adrian Del Castillo in the Miami Hurricanes. Adrian Del Castillo at first. The pitch is chopped towards third. McMullen has it. He'll go to short way to Acton at second. And the inning is over. No runs, a hit, no errors. One left on for Miami. Score. Garage behind the wall in right field. Here's the 0-2 pitch. Got him. L1-2. Rocks and fires. Got him! Van Bell strikes out the side. The Reigns here in Miami last year. 1-2 pitch. Swing and a miss. Good high hard heater from Tommy Mace. In Broadcasting again for the Washington Nationals. Had a nice big league career while he played and now he's been a broadcaster ever since then. Three up, three down. Go the Hurricanes. Two pitches to record his first six outs tonight. He can make that five strikeouts. And he shoots one into right field for the Florida Gators' first hit of the night. And that's where I think the Gators and the, and the, and the Hurricanes had a little bit of a, a heated exchange. As we have the runner thrown out, Rivera trying to run here. From Del Castillo, 0-2 the count. See you later. That flag doesn't look like it's 17. That's a little bit stiffer than 17. Swing and a miss, strike three. Lala goes down swinging. On 0-2, now 0-2 count again. Seven strikeouts on the night for Brian Van Bell. McMullen waves at a changeup. That pitch is swung on and missed a slider. That sat high in the zone, and Villar goes down on strikes. Swing and a miss, strike three. Raymond Gill goes down swinging. That's a ball off the fist there because you're, they're so worried about that changeup. 2-2, two, two, ground ball right side. Terrell has it to first, not in time. That's going to go down as a base hit for Corey Acton. He shows bunt, pushes it up the first base line. Terrell has it. He can't apply the tag and everybody is safe. Here's the payoff pitch, and it's low and inside. Ball four. The bases are loaded with Gators. And creeping onto the grass. Here's the 0-1 pitch, and it's a line drive out the short. They might double them off. The ball is thrown over towards first, and the Gators are going to get a run out of it. An error by Villar at short. They tried to double up Young at second. And one out. Rivera batting, and the pitch. A ground ball to third. Gill steps on the bag at third. A throw over the first, and the inning is over. But the Gators get one in the top of the fifth. Is ahead of Page, one and two. Here's the pitch. Got him swinging. A big old fist pump from Tommy Mace. He's got eight. Eight strikeouts for Brian Van Bell. Nothing wrong with that last call. 2-2. Two, two. Ground ball over the bag at first and a fair ball down the line. It's going to be two for Jordan Lala. Over to pick it up quickly is Young. He slides into second. He's in there. It's a leadoff double for Jordan Lala here to start the bottom of the sixth inning. And he's a left-handed hitter going against a righty. One-two. Swing and a miss. Strike three. 
Mace got him with a slider. There's one out here in the sixth inning. And your roll here and just get the job done. There's a ball in the air, center field. Fabian lines it up, tagging from third. Here's the throw to the plate. Not in time, we've got a tie ball game. Two outs, tie ball game, bottom six. Here's the pitch, ground ball right side, into the shift, right to Acton. He throws the first, and the inning is over, but not before the Hurricanes get a run. There's the nothing and one from Van Bell. It's a line drive out to center field. It's going to get down for a base hit. Jenkins over to collect it. They'll hold Acton at second. Here's the 3 2. It won't be. Got him looking. A fastball caught the inside corner. It's the ninth strikeout of the night for Acton. Back towards home. Here's the pitch. Ground ball right side. Terrell bobbles it, has it, tosses underhand to Van Bell. The Canes are out of trouble here by the top of the seventh inning. Kaiser continues to loosen it for Miami. Here's the one-two pitch, and it catches the inside corner. An 87-mile-an-hour slider. One and two now. It's in there for a cold strike three. Got him looking at a fastball on the inside corner. Today's game, and that's the importance of having a, a real good game on Friday night. Swing and a miss. Slider away. There's two outs. He takes off the pitch. In the air, playable, shallow right field. Out is Page battling the wind. He makes the catch, and the inning is over. Head run is at second. We're in the bottom of the eighth. Here's the pitch, and it catches the inside corner. Called strike three, Christian Scott is fired up. Gates works primarily out of the stretch. Oh, it's a good pitch by J.P. Gates for the first out of the inning. One, two, ground ball to short. Villar fires, got him. It's 1-1 after eight and a half innings in Miami. I guess he is through two starts. 2-1 is in the air. Right field, backing Young up, edge of the warning track, makes the catch. What do you say we head to extra innings in Coral Gables tonight? Bullpen after serving as the designated hitter. That's a good pitch, and he rung him up on the inside corner. Another strikeout for J.P. Gates. That's his second. Here's the 1-1 pitch to Josh Rivera, and it's hit down the first baseline. A fair ball that might get into the corner. Over to grab it is Rivera. Josh Rivera's got a stand-up double with two outs here in the top of the 10th inning. Going to cover up the lines. And that pitch is low in the dirt. He's going to take off for third. Del Castillo's going to have to put it in his back pocket. Strikes. Two balls, two strikes, two outs. Here's the pitch. In the air, playable. Right field. Rivera over near the line, reaches up, makes the catch. You lose the DH. Now here's the one. Oh, it's in the left center field. It's down for a base hit. The Hurricanes have the leadoff man on here in the bottom of the 10th inning. And J.P. Gates. Stays put. The pitch. Ground ball right side. Fielded cleanly by Acton. Let's head to the 11th in Coral Gables tonight. It's 1-1. One to one. One more time. Swing and a miss, strike three. Got him with a changeup. Here's the one, two. Back up the middle and a base hit. A nice piece of hitting by Austin Langworthy. The other thing now is because of the runner at first base, you had that big hole right there. And that's what I was about to say. They're going to send him to third. We might have a play. No, it's going to get cut off. And the Gators have runners on the corners with nobody out or one out. Getting out of the inning. Here's the one two pitch. And he got him. Swing a fastball up and away. That. First pitch to Jacob Young is a ground ball over the bag at third and a fair ball. It's down the line. The Gators have the lead. Langworthy's in to score. Butler is in to third and he's safe. And here's a ground ball towards first. A nice play by Alex Sorrell. A flip over to Fetterman, and they got him by a whisker. Ball four and a leadoff walk to Anthony Villar of the Miami Hurricanes here in the bottom of the 11th inning. Swing and a miss, strike three. Got him on a changeup. Payoff pitch. Does Villar take off? No, he stays put. Ball in the air, right center. 
over Fabian, catches it. There's two outs here in the 11th. Pogue is looking to shut it down for the Florida Gators. The pitch in the air. This should do it. The Florida Gators have taken game one from the Miami Hurricanes on Friday night in Coral Gables. Two to one the final, Weecho.